Hello and welcome to this section. In this section I will speak about regression types. Here you can see our playing field again. Regression is our first building block. It is a supervised learning technique with a continuous variable. There are many different parameters and terms that you should understand. The first important parameter is the number of independent variables. If you only have one independent variable, this is called univariate regression. If you have many different independent variables, this is called multivariate regression. The next important parameter is the number of dependent variables. The most usual case is that you have one dependent variable. This is called single target. But it is also possible to create models with more than just one target variable. In this case it is called multi-target regression. Finally, the order of the relationship between independent and dependent variable is important. This relationship might be linear, first order, quadratic, which means second order, or it might be any other order. Let's talk about the most simple case, univariate linear regression. Assume you want to predict the price of a house and the most important parameter is the living size. The data is completely artificial, I made it up myself for just showing the principle. At the right side, you can see there is one column with an independent variable, size, which is used to predict one dependent variable, the price. If the relationship between these data is linear, you can call it univariate linear regression. The image shows an example visualization. You can see the blue dots. These are the observed points. If you can put a straight line through these points and they fit the observations reasonably well, linear regression is the right fit for this. Later, we will discover what reasonably well really means and how we do this. But now we move forward. We make it a bit more realistic, but also a bit more complex. Let's speak about multivariate linear regression. Now we have more than one independent variables. And we want to predict one dependent variable. What you are fitting to the observed points is not a straight line anymore, but rather a plane, if you have two independent variables. Multivariate linear regression is the most relevant technique that we will see in real-life problems. So far, we assumed that the order of the relationship is 1 and we have linear regression. It might be that a higher order polynomial fits the data much better. So, in difference to our previous models for multivariate regression, we now have multivariate higher order regression. The order might be quadratic or even higher. In case of two independent variables, you are not fitting a straight line anymore, but rather a curved surface. A specialty is multi-target regression. In this case, you don't only have two or more independent variables, but also two or more target variables. You won't encounter this very often in real life, but it is useful to know that there are certain techniques for this to cover as well. It can be implemented, for example, quite easily with deep learning techniques. So that's it for this lecture. Thank you very much and see you in the next one.